I actually, when, it, when I got the phone call, I was driving in the, uh, in the car, and uh, I answered the phone on speakerphone, and all of a sudden, hello, is this John Dodd? And I'm like, yes, hi, it's Bob. And I'm like, Bob, yeah, 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 Bobby De Niro. I'm wondering if you'd be available to come to LA for a week or two. So I says, yeah, let me think about it. <laughs> yes, I can make it. <laughs> I am from Derry City, Northern Ireland. I have been uh, living in New York for the last 12 years. At home, I was an amateur fighter for 12 years, and then uh, I wanted to turn professional, which was brought me to New York. Uh, I retired four years ago, and now I've been pursuing acting for this last four years. I've been very unfortunate with uh, my boxing history because it's, it's led me in to uh, some opportunities that I might not uh, have gotten. I was able to work with De Niro, uh, I trained him for uh, six weeks before he did a movie called Grudge Match. And because of that uh, relationship that we made when training together, uh, he, he called me whenever uh, there was an opportunity of uh, a role in a, the, a movie Hands of Stone about Roberto Duran. I mean, I, it's fascinating that I, I left home 12 years ago to New York to pursue boxing. And, and, and since I, I fulfilled my dreams as a boxer, I'm now pursuing acting. And, and strangely enough, I seem to be going home more often now to act. It's, a, it's funny how you come here pursuing one dream and then when it changes this day and hour, I find out that my home is just as good a pathway to get there as anywhere else. I'm working with a playwright called Daniel McCabe. I did a play with him last year at the New York International Fringe Festival which was received very well. The Derry Playhouse is interested in having us come back to perform it, and also the Lyric in Belfast. But like this last few years, you've had the City of Culture, which was uh, immense. I mean, people came from all over. And then uh, you also had the, the BBC Big Weekend. And I'm here in New York, and I'm calling my mom just to check in. And uh, I, I didn't realize that this Big Weekend was happening. Uh, my mom answers the phone. Sorry, son, Bruno Mars is coming on. Boop. She hung up on me. I mean, like, what? So that's, that, that's great. Like, even when I was growing up, you never had concerts like that in Derry. You know, so uh, it's nice to see the direction that home has taken and the people. And it, it seems to be much more uh, prosperous and happy and uh, just open, you know? So uh, that's, uh, yeah, that's one of the main reasons I'm so proud to be from Derry. Whenever you've got, like, uh, organizations like Northern Irish Connections coming here and promoting where I come from and uh, giving uh, people like myself and other people from Northern Ireland the opportunity to work together, inspire to find something, to, to pursue something and uh, I mean that's fantastic. Mm -hmm.